What's going on guys? Danny Lanier Lawn Care. Today we're going to go over an iPhone mount or uh, Android if you got the Galaxy, whatever the case may be. But I have really enjoyed, I've had this for probably a year now and I've really enjoyed everything about this mount. Um, not only can I mount it to, you know, the handlebars of my lawnmower on my zero turn or whatever if I wanted to. Now, um, I don't think it would work on certain uh, most stand-ons because of how small the bars are. But if you got a sit down, you know, and you wanted to mount it to where your phone was right there beside you, you could do that. But I use this for my car. I use it for my motorcycle and things of that. I'll show you how this works. Tell you a little bit about it and uh, see what you think. Now, when I bought this, I bought the uh, handlebar mount. I bought a knuckle. I bought the uh, the case um, for my phone. I bought the car mount, and I also bought the dampener to go along with it for my Harley. So. Uh, let's tell you a little bit about this. This is called quad lock and you can go to quadlockcase.com and check this out. They make stuff for your home. They make uh, tripod mounts. I mean, just about anything, um, car mounts, motorcycle mounts. You can, you can get it for the handlebar mount or you can get it for the stem mount of your, you know, motorcycle. Uh, however you want to set these up pretty much. You can even get them with, uh, the, you know, the little, I don't even know what they call them, the little slide in pieces or whatever that slide into this. So you can, you know, use it to hold your phone, the rings or whatever uh, some people have. Now, the one thing that uh, I wish they would come out with, and I've talked to a lot of people that, that said that they would love it, is the uh, pop sockets that you could slide in here and, you know, slide out. So when you're not on your bike or in your car, you're in your house or whatever, you could put a pop socket in there and use it and, uh, you know, go on with your day or whatever. So with that said, let's uh, jump into this video. Let's show you this on the bike. I will show you the car mount as well that I have. A couple of different ways you can mount that. Now, this is no way affiliated with uh, Quad Lock. I paid for all of this 100% on my own. I just wanted a way to mount my uh, phone to my bike in a better way and while I was at it decided to go with the car mount as well And let's just say I'm not sad that I did but let's show you the back of this case real quick and uh, show you what you can <laughs> my son uh, Show you what you can expect. So this is the quad lock case and what it does is if you notice There are little pieces in here and it just slides in We'll show you how that works and it locks into place and then you don't have to worry about anything um, when it comes to, you know, it falling out because it locks in. So what you're looking at is the mount on my Harley here. And so uh, now I did add the dampener. This is, there's so much vibration in this that I added that. So uh, I didn't have to worry about anything, but this is just the handlebar mount mounted on here. And then this is how you lock and unlock. And so what happens is when you take your phone you just put it on there and then twist. And if you hear that click, then it's locked into place. It's not going anywhere. And to unlock it, all you do is press this lever back here and twist it back off. Now you can put this in landscape mode or whatever you want to do. So you can use it totally different ways. And then this is your unlock part. So this has really been a great investment uh, that I've been using and like I said, it just slides on there and then locks into place Use this to unlock it. Now this comes with a blue lever But I decided to upgrade so I paid ten extra dollars for this black lever right here I believe the dampener was 20 bucks uh, But let me tell you all in all I do not regret this purchase one bit. It has been totally totally great So let's show you the car mount All right, so now we're in the truck here, and as you can tell, this is it. So this has come with what they call a dash mount. So I actually have a dash pad right here. This is 3M'd, and it mounts to the dash. And then this blue part is just, if I undo it here, you see it pop up. It's just a uh, 
window suction pretty much that suctions to this little black disc so if i wanted to undo this i could turn it around and mount it to my window this is also adjustable right here of how you um, mount it or you know whatever the case may be however you want to have it turned or look towards you or up or down or whatever you want then you can adjust this as well so it's pretty much a completely adjustable but you can also get a wireless charger um, you can get uh, a charger like and it mounts right here to this so when you put your phone on there then it starts charging your phone so you don't have to run a cord you know up through or whatever but i still believe that you would have to run a cord uh, for the wireless charging i believe it just connects to you know this somehow and and runs through uh, a different way but to where you you know you don't have to plug it in every time you could just get in your vehicle or you can even do it on your motorcycle and uh just turn it on there and it'll automatically start charging for you so this is the car mount as uh you know this is the dash part of it but you can once again mount it to the window all right guys so that's pretty much going to do it for this video like i said you can go to the just type in quad lock on your search and they sell home office uh, motorcycle bicycling um, i mean just about anything and everything that you could want only thing i don't see i'm doing is a pop socket yet but maybe in the future so once again that's going to do it for this video if you have any questions feel free to comment down below i'll try to answer them to the best of my ability but until next time don't forget to like comment subscribe i am danny and i will see you in the next one Thank you.